वेलकम फ्रेंड्स यू आर वॉचिंग युअर चैनल क्वालिटी गुरु इंडिया एंड आई एम युअर होस्ट अमित कुमार मिश्रा आई हैव ए वेरी रिच एक्सपीरियंस इन द फील्ड ऑफ ऑटोमोटिव प्रोडक्ट्स क्वालिटी आई एम सर्टिफाइड ऑन आई ए टी एफ विद लीन सिक्स सिग्मा ब्लैक बेल्ट ग्रीन बेल्ट विद सिक्स सिग्मा ग्रीन बेल्ट एंड टूडे आई एम इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू विद अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक दैट इज कॉल्ड टोयटा प्रोडक्शन सिस्टम टू अचीव मैन्युफैक्चरिंग एक्सीलेंस दिस सिस्टम इज वेरी मच रिक्वायर्ड एंड आई एम ऑल्सो सर्टिफाइड ऑन टोयटा प्रोडक्शन सिस्टम फ्रॉम आई आई टी रुड़की सो प्लीज बी विद मी टिल द एंड ऑफ द सेशन सो दैट यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड दिस टोयटा प्रोडक्शन सिस्टम थोरोली एंड यू कैन इंप्लीमेंट इन योर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन परफेक्टली विद माई नॉलेज ऑन टोयटा प्रोडक्शन सिस्टम आई वुड से ओनली अंडरस्टैंडिंग दिस कॉन्सेप्ट एंड फॉलोइंग द सेम इज नॉट गोइंग टू हेल्प यू टू अचीव द डिजायर्ड रिजल्ट ऑफ टोयटा प्रोडक्शन सिस्टम मेनी ऑर्गेनाइजेशंस has opted toyota production system renamed as per their organizations name put in their organizations but the results are not achieved as toyota company has achieved the difference is that this is not only a tools and techniques which has to be implemented and learned this is a uh, differ from that i would say this is the philosophy of not only tools and techniques this is we need to use heart and mind if we learn toyota with the heart and apply the mind 100% then only we can achieve the desired results from the toyota production system let's understand this toyota production in detail and in today's session we will understand four p's of toyota production system and 14 principles of toyota production system let's understand the start of this toyota production system it was done by mr taichi onho uh, who is the father of toyota production system he developed this toyota production system in the toyota manufacturing organization and some wordings are about that How, why we should implement this toyota production system toyota production system says that most business processes are 90% waste and only 10% add value these wordings gives us a chance to understand that our processes are having 90% waste and then using this toyota production system you have a chance to eliminate those 90% waste processes or waste usage of things which can definitely going to help you in achieving the desired quality faster delivery and of course the reduced cost and some quote from mr taichi onho before moving to four p's he said if you are going to implement tps in your organization you must need to change the way you think you need to change how you look the things because toyota production as i earlier said that toyota production is not about learning the tools and technique it's more to that learning the culture implementing the culture understanding your organization your competence lot of things that's why i said it's a game of heart and mind not only tools and technique let's understand these four p's of toyota production system 
in the bottom you can say there is philosophy this is the foundation of toyota production system and then comes process process means toyota believes that if your process is good then only you can get the quality products or good products and then comes the people people are the asset of organization as per toyota production system they give the most value to the people and then problem solving toyota production system emphasizes on problem solving and continuous learning and improving this four p's have 14 principles and then in the coming slides i will explain you about those 14 principles and in philosophy section one principle is there that base management decision on long term philosophy in toyota production system decisions are taken on not only day to day requirement basis it is done on the basis of long term philosophy basis and then next is process and in process seven uh, are there and one is create continuous peace flow or continuous flow or single peace flow this continuous flow somewhere it is called jit and it give gives organizations a chance to surface out the problems in the organization and then standardize task standardization means all agreed method whatever process whatever method you are doing you need to freeze that so that everyone can use in the same way and your result is predictable then use the pool system pool system is basically means it related to demand of customer whatever customer ask you just produce and sell not on the basis of that you produce first and then you approach to customer and then give the delivery and then use visual controls visual controls we all know that has a very huge impact on anything if a organization using this visual controls finding anything is a matter of seconds if you are not using this visual tools properly then if you have to find anything that can be a kiosk and then comes level out workload we need to find out what are next in the processes we need to find out machines are properly utilized that is called hyjunka or level out workload so that work can be distributed amongst all equally and we can get the desired result and we can use the uh, resources completely and then use only tested technology toyota says that don't rush for technology technology should be for help of people and those technologies only be used taken those are tested many technologies are coming in the market but without tested if you are using those technologies maybe they are helpful for your organization and maybe not helpful for your organization in that way you are wasting your resources so use only thoroughly tested technologies and then stop line it says if there is a no need of production just because you have to run the machine you are running is not a good idea we should stop the line that time and then comes the people section and then in the people toyota gives a lot of emphasis and the first thing is that respect develop your people and your partners 
they give huge respect to their people they give opportunities to develop them they involve in the problem solvings and then also they involve their partners to learn with them and grow with them and then next is respect develop and challenge your people to grow they give respect to their people they give chance to develop their people they allow people to take part in analysis innovation uh kaizens and other things with give them challenging tasks so that they can grow from their uh, current situations and also toyota believe that the top management or management should be from their team only so that they can understand the philosophy of toyota they can understand the processes of toyota they can understand the visions and mission of the organization and those people should be promoted as leader it should not be purchased leaders many organizations purchase leaders and that cannot be a good for the growth of organization as per toyota and then respect and develop and challenge your partners this is a unique thought not only your people you challenge your partners so that they can also be competent with your requirements and they can help you in the future now fourth is problem solving in the problem solving they say that become a learning organization through continual improvement doing kaizens and doing other things so that you be competitive always and then next is see yourself uh the philosophy says that whenever there is a problem management people should go to the actual place go in the gamba where the work is happening and then see yourself khud se dekho what is happening there and then take the actions and then making decisions by taking consensus toyota believes in cooperation collaboration and teamwork so that's why this philosophy is there that decision should not be taken by only one person take the view of other people take the consensus from other people so that all can take part all can give their inputs and decisions can be taken collaboratively i hope i have explained four p's and 14 principles of toyota production system in a 10 minute video it is not justified to give complete toyota production system i'll make further videos on toyota production system where i will give you a detail on toyota production system even for 14 principles only we will be required to make 14 videos in the future soon i will come with this videos where you will get the complete toyota production knowledge if you find that i have explained four p's and 14 principles well then please subscribe my channel please like my video and share to your friends and colleagues so that they can also take the part in this knowledge sharing journey also if you find any idea for improvement please mention me through comment section to improve further thanks for watching my video